Did Gary just talk? Um. <clears throat> yes. Yep. Yeah, yeah. I know the time does not stand still. Can see the world when it's spinning, spinning. Try to pin me down. You don't have a clue. Wouldn't understand if I showed you, showed you. <sighs> this is oh. nice, right? Oh, yeah, this is nice, of course. I mean, so much nicer than, like, where I was at. Yeah. Like, earlier. In that deep, dark cage. Maybe you should <laughs> think about it. Well, yeah. I mean, but it's kind of hard to not think about something that literally happened like 12 yeah. hours ago i i know now yeah, you can I probably see why i had such a hard time with you and brian before because imagine that thing right except it being in the form of brian and actually killing yeah. you I, I can't even imagine what i would have done had i had it actually done something to harm you yeah i mean i mean he he's, he was for sure hurting me that seductive rose yeah. i i'm honestly surprised that he didn't do anything to really try to end me or whatever well he certainly had a plan to but we yeah, got there was... just in time i guess i guess and well, you know, what matters is Seductive Rose is no longer, you know, part of Brian. It's something alone, and yeah. I got out. And now we actually should be worried because there's this big thing, but I, I guess, you know, it's something to be worried another day. Yeah, and Brian was pretty, you know, he, yeah. he, wanted, he, he to really wanted to defeat it yeah, on he, his own. Yeah, so... so... I guess that's not gonna... really our place. Yeah, it's not really, unless he asked for it. But, um... <sighs> but now, what, how uh... are you dealing with everything? I... Don't know. Like... I... Like, before I got captured by Brian, I... I mean, not Brian. Seductive, Seductive Rose. Rose. Yeah. My bad. Bad habit. Well... I was, like I told you, I was ready to to really, you know, start fresh, like, f for once, for real, like, really clicking this restart button, moving on from the past completely. I've been having such a hard time doing so. I keep, like, trying to move forward, but kind of something keep holding me back. But I, I feel like I'm finally ready, but then I got captured, and while I was being captured I I don't know what Seductive Rose did to me he he showed me something it was like in the form of Brian and just tell me a lot of things something like I have made a lot of mistakes I'm you know sinner I I I'm you know just a ter terrible person that you know I you know maybe realize that Maybe I can, maybe I am just trapped in this, this cycle, this never ending cycle. And I can never really move on. I'm always like really stuck. If I like, I can never like turn over a new leaf. If I never like really admit 
like or repay the sins I guess that I have done, the crimes that I've committed, or bad things that I've made, poor decisions. So I don't know. I just, but obviously those are just really just visions or words that meant to break me. Yeah, I mean, he was way. probably just targeting all of your weaknesses. Did, have you worried about those sort of things in the past? I mean, I, I, I guess I have to be um, honest that I was a bit obsessive um, with certain things. <laughs> you don't say. I, I was paying a lot of attention to back then when. I was trying to make things work with Brian. Mm -hmm. uh, I just had a vision. I, I, ne I, I never really had a lot of things that that I want because how I grew up and like uh, love and having a family with someone that I love is something that I always wanted and so I guess I'm just really you know focused on making that work and I kind of got lost so that's one thing that I feel like I've done and I've made a lot of poor decisions uh, yeah, that's understandable that. though I mean you have never told me much about your family but there's nothing wrong with wanting love and wanting someone to share a family with that doesn't make yeah. you a bad person and sure it might have clouded your judgment a bit but it's not your fault what if I've what if um, there's something even worse what do you mean like um I, um I mean like like you want something so bad and you know you're so close to having it and then one day you just lose it all like what would what would it make you feel would you react in a certain way or well i mean if there was something i really wanted and i was close to getting it and then i lost it i i would be upset I'm not sure what exactly I do. It depends on the context, but I'm sure well, I'd probably be capable of making a mistake or two, or at least having poor poor judgment. Well, I I don't know how to say, but there may or may not have been someone that was trying to stop me from getting, you know. Uh, what I deserve, love, and and he or she took it away from me, and I've confronted and I've made some poor choices and actions. Well, I mean, at least you recognize that they were poor choices and poor actions you've acknowledged that and I mean yeah. I don't know exactly the situation and nor do I need to right but right you, you don't no I I mean that's your business but you can't dwell on everything that's happened in the past river eventually you have to just be able to look forward and you know like I said before, love yourself and forgive yourself for those wrongdoings and those mistakes, right? Right. Yeah, I mean, that's what I've been trying to do and it's not been easy. I just felt like because it's so hard, maybe it was never going to happen to me, but I guess I guess no one ever said it was easy, I guess, moving on. <laughs> no, so it's, it's actually quite the opposite. It's very, very difficult. And it's going to take time and patience and probably a lot more heartache than happiness at first. But you'll get right. there eventually. Well, 
I guess I'm glad I have you along. <laughs> well, I'm guess, happy to be here. Thinking back, I honestly don't know what what I would have been, become without without you uh, <laughs> in here to always just give me advice and just be there. <laughs> well, what are best friends for, am I right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Anyways, enough of this uh, yeah. sadness and the dwelling on the past. How yeah. about you and me do some karaoke? Hmm? Um, I mean, it's late, but um, yeah, but sure. everyone's probably in their cabins. Who or... cares? Yeah. We're the camp counselor. We, <laughs> we can we make wake the them up. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I have just the song in mind. Set me free Every time your hands on me I wanna be your way to shine I can't deny The feel that you give to me You let the spark the center fire Oh no Don't run away from your life No, no Don't turn away from the heart of the groove From, from the, the way that we move, move. Kill the lights we can lose Touch my body 
close your eyes You can see me by the way that I feel Come spin me around Let's get lost in the sound Close your eyes You can see me by the way that I feel Touch my body Kill the lights Hey, Kayla, you're what? back. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, um, sorry. I made you spill something. It, it's okay. It was just tomb juice. Uh, luckily, we have more in the fridge. You startled tomb me a bit. Juice? Oh, yeah, you, uh. Yeah, the leg yeah, the legs. situation. I kind of have to How you been? It. Uh, Where you been? De decent. And, well, I went and traveled a bit. Um, what? about you did uh, Gary don't sip that yeah Gary I wouldn't drink that if I were you yeah oh, been... I'm sorry wait what I... Uh, I, I'm sorry did... uh, wait G <clears throat> Gary what's up did Gary just talk um <clears throat> yes yep yeah G Gary? Gary? Hi! Can you understand me? Y yes, 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 we can y understand yes. you. Uh, huh? He just sipped the, ju the juice. He sipped tomb juice? Now he has human vocal cords? I, 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 I guess. Oh, or a voice, at least. Um. Yeah. How you doing, Gary? <laughs> I, I've, been, I've been good, you know. I've been seeing Angelina. It and knew? a few yeah. of other ladies, you know, you know, you've seen Wait. all the, you know, the snails. I have seen a yeah. lot of snails over by my cat. Sorry, it's just going to take okay. me a second to realize yeah. we're talking to a snail, our snail. We are snail? talking to a snail. <laughs> we sure we haven't had any tomb juice. It's just, uh. I mean, I've yeah. had some, yeah. but. Well, yeah, after the legs. Are you sure you have? Are this we is crazy. dreaming? Are we both having the same dream right now? Nah, I can't just share a dream. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, that's what? not how life works. No, I guess not. No, it's not. Well, yeah. how have you been, Sarah? Um, I was just telling her, it's been a little bit rough with everything crazy happening around camp. Just got back from uh, a, yeah. a wedding. All those ladies. Mm. Brian. Uh, <laughs> all the ladies? Yeah, why did you take that cat lady to the wedding. What? The cat lady? Is he talking oh, about Momiji? Oh, Momiji. He's talking about. Wait, 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 wait. You and Momi? I thought she was with Rikaro. You it's took her to the very... wedding? No, no, it's a very, Zylo. very complicated situation. It was not like that. It's I... She's got, gone a little evil, and I was keeping an eye on her so she didn't suck anyone's power out. Nothing weird about it. Right. Yeah. Um, anyway, that was that was one extremely isolated situation. Okay. Well, he did say ladies, meaning Gary. Multiple. Was there any others, Gary? Oh, I see all. <laughs> yep. I'm all over the place. I know you are, Gary. It's just you don't need <laughs> to tell her about all the things, right? I mean, why not? Why not tell me? What, what, I mean, what secrets are you trying to hide? It's not very important secrets at all. It's you know, I, you you keep your no, but uh, they're, they're life pretty. Life to yourself, I can keep mine to myself. Hey, That's fine. I I don't have any secrets to hide. I've told you basically everything since the beginning. Yeah, yeah, I Honesty guess so. Is key. Mm -hmm. What? Honesty is key. Honesty is key. Sure. You should listen to the snail. Yeah, that's. Pretty insightful, Gary, but, uh, you know, if we just don't tell her about, you know, the, with Lee, it's fine. You know, the centaur girl around camp, that's... Okay, so you and, with, you and Lee. Just, you know. <laughs> yeah, the situation with me and Magnus never worked out, that's fine. Just just don't tell her about the situation with, with, with me and Mania. Oh, yeah, that time that you were a lady. No, no. Get, oh. 
Uh, you. Oh, it's interesting. What? He was a lady. You <clears throat> were a, a lady. Well, yes, I'm certainly not anymore, am I? I mean, I don't know if you're questioning who you are. I mean, I support it wholeheartedly. I... No, th that's not what this is. Uh, Gary, fine, you explain. Well, um, there is this lady, and, uh, she kind of got possessed. Yeah. But, wait, do, do, wait, 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 wait. You possessed somebody? Well, not, I wasn't the first one to do it. Oh, so it's just because demon. someone else does it makes it okay? Well, I, I possessed her to get the demon out, and it worked. I'm gone for, that I, from camp for how many days when this happens? <clears throat> look, I was only inside her for like a week. How you been, dude? Uh, I haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, I'm sorry, Gary. Um, I, I've been okay. I got the information I was wanting. Um, I know my dad's alive and hopefully well. Uh, Wait. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Isn't the whole reason you, let's just say, attacked me last year was because my, what you thought was dad was responsible for the death of my uh, You know what? Mom. It's complicated. Yeah. I, I, I attacked you because you were a descendant of Apollo and then it turns out I, myself, am, am a, a dis descendant yeah. of Apollo. It, it's kind and of... And he's alive and well, I, mean, oh, I attacked sure. you because my mom was dead. Uh, Apollo wasn't the cause of my dad's supposed death. It was actually Hades. Um, but we don't have to talk uh, well, about it. Okay. Uh, um, that just complicates things further. Yeah, yeah no. Uh, no, I feel no like tension here. Uh, no, it's not tension. tension. We, no. I feel like we've been through our share of tension. Yeah. No. Um, no, we're good now. We're good. Yeah. But I'm glad. I'm glad he's alive. Thanks. I've recently been figuring something about it, out about my mother, so well, hopefully I'll be able to find her. Don't got any substantial clues, but yeah, if you're not too busy there. with any of the other ladies in your life, that is okay. It's <laughs> once again not like that. I'm much more busy Gary. with the men in my life right now. Uh -huh. oh. No, also not like that, Gary. Well, there was that one kiss with Davis, but it, it, that, that doesn't count. I didn't start it, and it wasn't even my body anyway. Juicy. No, it wasn't juicy. Uh, wait, so you kissed Davis? Yeah, and... while I was inside Mania. While I was possessing Mania. Poor choice of words there. <laughs> it, it's hard to explain. It just happens a lot. Yep. I'm just but yes. gone from camp for a couple of days and all this happens. Uh, I, I see. Okay. I'm sorry. It's a little difficult sometimes. Uh, no, it's, it's fine. I'm just saying at some point you should probably, you know, find the right person, settle down, and just stop, you know. Yeah, why don't you settle forth. down with her? Well, I just, I'm sorry. I can't just have my, you know, happy little Cario moment. It's been a little hard for me. I mean, understandable, I, I guess, but I don't know. Just try and find someone normal and, and nice. It's so difficult here. It's so difficult. Um, I mean, there's Kayla. What? G Gary, I... With someone else? Yeah, it's her and Mario are together. I don't know if you've noticed, Gary. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, have you seen Mario lately? Yeah. What's wrong with Mario? He's not doing too hot. Yeah. Yeah, he's... Well, a lot's happened to him, and I feel like he snapped a little. Okay. He's been getting angry and distant, and the other day he attacked me. Oh. Yeah, because, well, he made up some reason about me being better than him and him wanting to prove himself, and I told him it's nothing like that, that I needed him, and then he shocked me with a lot of lightning. So. I, s I see. I'm definitely gonna have to have a chat with him yeah, before I go. He, he really needs someone right now. And as much as I'd like to help him out, I don't think it can be me. Yeah. Hey, before you take care of others, gotta make sure you take care of yourself. Yes. Yeah. That's, that's nice, Gary. <laughs> he has a lot of others to take care of, though, and a lot of people that are dependent on me. But mm -hmm. you can't and help they can't those people. On you. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can't depend on you if you're not dependable. Mm -hmm. Not to say you're not dependable, but if you don't take you care of yourself. You two ganging up on me? I. It, yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I see how it is. And I thought you were a Kalo shipper. Wow. You're I helping mean, her against me. I'm okay. just trying to create a little moment between you two. No, we don't need no, a moment, wait, no. Gary. <laughs> that would be incredibly weird. Nah. -uh. It would be pretty weird, Gary. It'd be pretty. I mean, have you <laughs> seen him? <laughs> Not my type. Not really. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, but uh, no, I was just uh, grabbing some tomb juice. Um, I've actually got to head over, see the oracle, and then I'm going to be on my way here pretty shortly. So soon? Yeah, um, with the information that I've got and I hope to get from the oracle, I, I really feel like I'm super close to finding my dad. And well, I hope... You're Nothing happens while I'm gone. <laughs> Seemingly, a lot has happened at camp since I've left last time, but... Are you sure you can't stay a little longer? I... Just a bit. <laughs> I mean, I'll stay as long as I can, but I... Okay. I do have to finish this. I have a good feeling about it, you know? Yeah, I'd hate for you to lose the opportunity, I guess. Yeah. I know where you're coming trust from. Trust your gut. Yeah. Always trust your gut. Will do. And my gut says go, even though my brain, knowing everything that's happened since I've left... Uh, I'll do what I can to hold everything together. You know the seductive rose is back too, right? Yes, I know! Okay, cause uh... That's like number four on my list of problems, it's that bad. Well, according to Brian, he really wants to handle it himself, but... Which is helpful, it really is. Yeah. The first night I came back to camp, uh, the seductive rose took river. So. Is he okay? Uh, yeah, um, a little shaken up still, and uh, I uh. think he's gonna need some time to get back to normal, but I, I think he'll be okay. Uh, but then someone showed up here also last night while we were hanging out, and I, I don't know. I don't know who it was. Uh. Oh, no. What? There, 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 there was another girl that he took me to meet on the moon. That one, too. <laughs> Wait, you went to the moon? Yeah, me and him went to the moon. So I could distract a, you know, demigoddess so he could steal something from her. Well, that sounds romantic. How was she? No, it, it wasn't romantic. She was awful. Oh, I'm sure she wasn't yeah. that bad. Maybe you're just being too picky. So I don't think I'm being picky. She she was very controlling and she, she just had the most annoying voice. Nah. I don't, I, I don't think she would have been that bad, right, Gary? Oh, Gary? Come on, you're not going to back me up on this one? Oh. Seriously? I think the tomb juice might have worn off. Oh. I guess it's better than him ignoring me but uh, just know if he were to still be talking he would 100 percent back me up i don't know maybe he would back me up <laughs> no i doubt it i mean look at the way he's looking at you he is looking at me hey i'm the one who kept you know jakey out of camp i mean we both kind of kept jakey out of camp yeah keeping gary safe yeah so. and we both brought you back from the underworld yeah, but so. I had to die in order for you to come to the underworld in the first place. So really, I mean, I have the upper hand here. I was the one that kind of like, you know, kind of enabled us coming back from the underworld. I mean, I mean no, yeah, I, I'm 100% like but. thankful for that. But I'm just saying I had to take a knife through like the stomach or sword. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't think it needed to happen necessarily. I mean, no. you could have just not gotten stabbed out. Then that would have been preferable. Yeah, but then we wouldn't have Gary here, so. I mean, we could very well have Gary here. We could have gone to the underworld together and then got Gary back. You know, happy time. Don't even get me started on Popsicle. I can't believe you would bring up Popsicle. Anyways, I'm going to get my tomb juice and uh, probably talk to Mario and be on my way. Uh, Gary, Bye. why don't you come with me? <laughs> 
I'm the favorite. See if you can make him. You asked him to go with you. Yeah. And I didn't say. Why wouldn't he? Come on, Gary. Wow. I'll see you later. See ya. I hope. Oh,